I wanted to talk about plagiarism today. And I know it's a really, really mundane subject, but I wanted to kind of give you guys an idea of why it's not a good idea to plagiarize. Now, I have recently found some information about Kenny K.O. Now, Kenny K.O. has been known for stealing content from other YouTubers, and he has flat out denied it multiple times. We also have someone else who actually plagiarized information and to a much, much grander scale, and that is Philip Mewson of IGN. Now, IGN recently fired him. He was fired, I believe, a few months ago, and they found so much dirt on him after he had left his employment at IGN. It's very likely that he may never be working in the journalism business ever again, even though he may form into a better human being after all this. I still don't think he will actually get a job in this. He probably won't even get a job in retail. So, yeah, being as scummy as he was, I don't think anyone would be willing to hire him. However, plagiarism in itself. And I'm talking about plagiarism just alone. Like, not focusing on Kenny K.O., not focusing on Philip Mewson. But it's plagiarism of content on YouTube, plagiarism of content in school, in just general life. Like, if you plagiarize anything, it's wrong. You're stealing someone's worth, work. And that's essentially theft. And there are plenty of YouTube channels out there that re-upload people's content. It does, they don't even try to change anything around. They shamelessly re-upload it. And they claim that it was something that they created and they get ad revenue off of it. Now, this has not happened to me. I hope it doesn't happen to me. Uh, it probably will if I do make it big on YouTube, but knowing how my channel is, I don't think it will. But looking at plagiarism in regards to what's happened recently with Philip Mewson and Kenny K.O., you have to wonder why they do it. You, you gotta wonder why they decided to plagiarize that content. Because again, if you are working in the journalism industry, and in Kenny K.O.'s case, working in the fitness industry, or just covering stuff about fitness, you would think if you're going to be making videos on YouTube, you would actually have creativity. You would be creative with the content that you are making. Unfortunately, that wasn't the case, and for some reason, they just decided to steal content, make money off of it, and claim it as theirs. Um, both Philip Mewson and Kenny K.O. shamelessly state that they did not plagiarize, even though the evidence, it's pretty obvious that they did. And I find it strange that they continually claim they did not do this. They're probably doing it just because of their fans and they feel as though at least with their fans they can, you know, continuously lie to them because they're so loyal. But even then, with your fans, you're not going to be able to, they're not going to stick around all that long. You know, some of them may be young right now, they may, they may be easy to fool, but as they grow older, they'll start finding out your shit and you will more than likely end up losing subscribers. And I, I, I don't get it. I just don't get it. I don't get why people resort to that. Because it, I, I'm on YouTube, right? Okay, I, I'm doing YouTube again. And one thing I know 100% that is 100% scummy is plagiarism on YouTube. It, it, it's 100% scummy stealing someone's content, committing theft, pretty much, and then making money off of it. That's that's like stealing something from someone's house and taking it to a pawn shop and selling it, or, or putting it in like a garage sale that, you, that you've set up for yourself, and you just decide to sell it. Why? Why, why, why do that? Why? <laughs> okay, why would... And it, it's even worse, because you're stealing someone's content on YouTube, you're, you're making it look like yours, you're saying everything word for word, and you're expecting not a single person who watches 
uh, fitness videos or, you know, game reviews to not pick up on this shit. Because I have no doubt there are people in that subscriber base who are subscribed to you and the people that you're plagiarizing from. Okay, there's a lot wrong with what you're fucking doing. Plagiarizing other people's shit. Claiming it's yours. And then outright fucking saying that you didn't do anything wrong. Even though the evidence points directly to you stating that you did something wrong and you are totally responsible for what you did. So yeah. That's my piece on this entire plagiarism bullshit. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys later.